I'm gonna be taking the little Thundercat out tomorrow, do some more breaking in. Previous video, we got to see what happens when you don't bolt the uh, motor on. So I bolted it on this time. Just kind of wanted to do a walk around of the boat, show you guys what these Chinese Thundercats look like. I built this trailer myself, just bought a beater trailer that the fenders were all mashed up on and put the bunks on it. So this thing sees a lot of trailer miles. So the main thing I wanted to do was make sure right here with that crossbar, it's super well supported with uh, two by sixes all the way around since the front tapers the rear isn't uh, wide enough to center the front centers and then I just use these little cross straps here to keep that guy center on there width wise and then those angle buddies guide it on when you're loading it in and out of the water pretty nice um, trying out a 14 pitch prop tomorrow the uh, <laughs> well I blew up the 15 so I've got this 14 it's got a lot of cupping on it so We'll see what that's all about with two of us in the boat. We're not looking for speed, really. This is our diving boat, so getting a nice medium, you know, speed on there. So uh, I'm pretty happy with it. The construction is pretty good, especially for how cheap these are. Um, these rear se seams here, that's those are welded. So a lot of times when you see tubes fail, it's usually this end seam. The rest are pretty much glued. I think these are 20 about 20 inch tubes so I even got uh, my own logo on there they do that for you that's pretty cool that's free got all the pouches and pads and uh, grips that uh, that I like and uh, I just got my little anchor and all the rope in a little bag here to keep it nice and happy in there I put in the uh, foam floor it's just the crap you can get on eBay um, I, I actually really like it. I already spilled gas on it, so that sucks. Um, but yeah, everything on it is pretty well made, I think, for the price. Um, tariff super sucks, but still definitely worth it. Um, yeah, and you can see I got the bunks going all the way up front. So this thing's well supported. I can haul gear in it down the road and everything. But uh, yeah. Didn't want to do this in the parking lot while we're getting ready to go dive, so I figured I'd do it now. Another thing that's super cool, if you can find these on eBay, these uh, dry bags. Got my wetsuit and all my gear in here. They're one of the only ones I can find that are cheap and they're like 48 inches long, so you can fit your full length fins in there. That's fantastic. Boat's getting a little grubby because I've been working on it a lot, but uh, yeah, there you have it. It's about almost 15 inches long so we'll uh, get some more video out tomorrow of us uh, tearing around in it